I heard people say that Marines came here to die. And I didn't like that. And uh, so I set out to prove him wrong. This is an aspect of the Marine Corps that a lot of Marines don't know about and a lot of the public definitely don't know about. From a performance standpoint, the Marines from the very beginning have to understand the psychology of the horse and the characteristics of the prey animal. We have to understand them in their, their natural state, physically and mentally, to be able to communicate with them. Then I began to teach them how to literally communicate physically, verbally, and mentally with the horse. When uh, Sergeant Jay was working with uh, Martini, He's using his body language and he physically said walk and then he also verbally said walk and the horse slowed down to a walk. So she's actually, and she looked at him to listen to him. So he has built a rapport with that horse to where it understands his body language and his verbal communication. They see the rewards that pay off for the long run and uh, they stick with it. So I, I'm proud of the way that they um, choose to think. As for me, I think that would be the most important factor. I'm not, I'm not worried about whether they come home with the blue ribbon. What I like to say to myself, and I say it to them, I say I'd like to see people give you a standing ovation because you have emotionally move them with your performance. That'll beat the blue ribbon every day for me. Depending on which horse you're on, it's always starting at square one. You try to build on your past accomplishments on the horse, so if you're able to do a certain move on the horse, you start there and then you try to make it a little bit more complex. You never know if it's going to work or not because horses have their own personalities. So if you can capitalize on the, the, the previous day's work and accomplishments, great. If not, and you have to back up and, and start over again to remind them this is what we accomplished already and then build on that, you do so. But it's, a, it's always an adventure because you never know exactly what you're going to get from the horse. Well, the horses will reveal what type of ethic that person has. They, they just don't lie. And I can see that as the Marine works with the horse and the horse performs with the Marine and I believe it affects their life. I believe however deeply or far that the Marine allows the horse to help them, that's how far it'll go.